Now with the launch of Android 10, we were introduced with the new gestural navigation and today in this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can install a port from Android 10 which is compatible with Android 9 and Android 10 devices. And please note that the back gesture that is available on Android 10 is uh, coded into the system and not into the launcher. So that will not be available. Well, everything else is available. So let's dive into it. You need requirements for everything so in order to install android 10 launcher you need to be on android 9 or android 10 anything below android 9 won't work yeah nothing below 9 like 8.1 or anything now make sure that you are rooted yeah unfortunately this is only for rooted users now you can be rooted with anything majesk super user or any app that grants you root access now there will be two files given in the description down below. Make sure that you download them. Now one is a launcher and another is a zip file named quick switch. Now go into module, hit on plus button and make sure that you flash quick switch first. It will take half a second to flash. Now make sure that you reboot your device. Otherwise it won't work. Now once your device is rebooted, unlock your device. Yeah, that's obvious. Unlock your device and make sure that you see quick switch something like this in your app launcher now go ahead into your file manager and locate where you have kept your launcher or the apk file now once you find the apk what are you waiting for install it okay click on continue click on install and wait until your launcher gets installed wait wait okay it's done now click on done and don't press the home button yet not yet don't be so eager okay keep pressing back buttons until you reach home now launch the app now if you are a custom rom user you will see two quick step launchers just choose the latest one and it will ask you to provide reasons and click on ok and you are good to go now even if you press home button by mistake don't choose any option don't do anything just press the back button and you will be fine okay yeah just don't press home button or choose any option now you have to reboot your device and there's a reboot option and it will reboot your device and once your device is rebooted that's obvious you have to unlock it okay now it will ask you to choose any one launcher so that's obvious you will choose the latest one once you have chosen that again press the home button and now this time make it always and this will be set as your default launcher now as you are on android pi you need to enable the option swipe up from home button so i will just navigate it and enable it you can do just by opening settings and searching for the option or it will be in settings about phone gestures and yeah you need to enable this option now you won't see any changes until you go and change the settings in the launcher now go into launcher settings or home settings go into developer options and you you will need to enable enable gestures full mode gestures and there's an apply button on top just hit on it and now there you go you see the newest pill icon that's introduced in android pi now yeah that's basically done you can enjoy everything now but this launcher is kind of buggy so you need to be little patient to use it and see the changes well rest of the things work pretty fine and everything is just so good like navigating throughout the ui with this launcher and everything and the animations are quite great so Thank you guys for watching hope you like this video and yeah please subscribe